It's a phrase everyone recognizes. That was a disaster waiting to happen. Usually it's true. There were signs that something was wrong, but no one did anything about them. They saw them, but didn't report them. And then, disaster struck. Out at sea, or in harbor, the maritime environment is full of potential dangers, and the industry sees a serious incident somewhere every day. That's why recognizing weak signals, the small things that just don't look, smell, or sound right, is so important. Weak signals are seemingly random or disconnected pieces of information that may appear in the background, an unexpected sound or vibration, or just an unscheduled maintenance request. All of these are weak signals, and often they will turn out to be nothing. But sometimes, they may be the first signs that something is about to go seriously wrong. Recognizing weak signals is a key part of being chronically uneasy. Sounds nasty, but it's not. It's a way of thinking about the world around you to avoid getting complacent about safety. Chronic unease helps you notice those weak signals and overcome your natural instinct to think that because everything is usually okay, then it's still okay. The point is, it might not be. Chronic unease makes you curious about anything that's even just a little bit off, or strange, or unusual, and report it. It is a major part of our approach to reaching a zero incident industry. We're working on achieving it, and recently the frequency of incidents has been going down steadily. People are reacting to weak signals. They are practicing chronic unease, but we need to get better at it. For instance, a recent engine room fire started because weak signals were missed. The vibrations on a ship can slowly loosen fittings, including those on a fuel line. In this case, some lagging protecting hot surfaces was missing. It had been that way a long time, and everyone had ceased to notice it. The missing lagging was a weak signal, but no one reported it. And then, when the fuel inlet fitting parted, Diesel sprayed out and started a fire when it made contact with the hot pipe. It was a disaster waiting to happen. A weak signal that led directly to a high impact incident. The marine industry is moving towards a new future where data can help us dramatically improve our safety. Shipping is now, for the first time, developing a predictive modeling tool called Hilo that uses data from weak signals to help predict serious incidents. Hilo relies on collecting data about weak signals. The more data it receives, the more accurate the predictions become. It's a potentially life-saving use of technology, but people are always the front line. It's how you deal with weak signals that counts.